All right, guys, we got a new listing here in Palmetto, Florida. And this is right on the corner of 69th and Ellington Gillette. So this is easy access to I-75, um, easy access to the Buffalo Creek area, easy access to Moccasin Wallow, and easy access to US 301 and Palmetto. So, um, and pretty easy access to I-75, you know, depending on which way you go. I mean, if you're headed south and you go down to 301 and catch um, I-75 south, if you're headed north, then you would hit um, Moccasin Wallow and hit the I-75 pickup there, and it's not too far away. Or if you wanted to go 275 to St. Petersburg, you would just head down 69th and hit 275 right there. Um, so, yeah, guys, pretty good. Uh, check out this location. Here's the road. So coming by Heron Creek, I'm headed south on Ellington Gillette in Palmetto. You're gonna come over here, and this next light up here is 69th. So you got a little uh, nursery right here on the right. And you got some acreage properties here, but then you know Park Parkside starts. This is the Parkside community in Palmetto. And that's it. This is actually 71st Street East. Now there's an entrance on 69th as well. Okay, it's a small little community. No like really amenities or anything like that. There is a playground right over here on this side that they share, but it's a nice area to walk. Walk around in. There's a little playground here on the right. And you can walk your dogs around here and like most of the lots on, on the outskirts, they don't have anything behind them. Like a little dead end here. And it's basically just like three streets and then a cul-de-sac down on the right. So um, it's a little small neighborhood. I'm, I wanna say it's like 150 homes. So just to give you an idea, this is not the actual street, but this is what the neighborhood looks like. You know, this is built in the um, uh, early 2000s, like 2012, I think it was like uh, between 2006 and 2010. And there's the house right here on the corner. So this is uh, 70th Court East and the house is right here on the corner. So yeah, guys, let's check it out. All right guys, hey, how's it going? This is Robert here with Realty One Group Skyline. Today I am in front of a brand new listing in Palmetto, Florida, and this is 3438 70th Court East in Palmetto, Florida, and that's area code 34221. And this is a three bedroom, two bath, block home, corner lot, 1,272 square feet. So we're gonna do a little walkthrough and a tour right now. And I'm gonna show you this, why this home is priced to sell at $379,000 in the heart of Palmetto, close to I-275, I-75, US-301, US-41, right in the middle of everything. Close to Moccasin Walla Road, guys. This is a prime location. Let's check out what this house has to offer. As you can see guys, it's nicely landscaped 
complete with irrigation system, sprinkler system, all throughout the whole property. You have this whole corner lot to yourself. That's no neighbors on the, I would say that's the north side of the street, on the north side of the property. So this home is actually facing, no, it's facing south. So that would be um, the east side. This home is faces south, backs up to the north. Beautiful landscaping. And it even has the, and I want to do this while the car is in the driveway so you can see the extra room that the driveway has. And this is on both sides. So it has the sideway extensions. So you can either try to squeeze another, maybe a vehicle in there if you scoot everything over. Or um, you have plenty of room to get out with your grocery bags and, and walk up to the house. You know, like stepping through the mulch beds. So like I said, block home, guys. It's a large 1272 square feet at this yard. Two car garage. Has the irrigation system, fenced in yard, screened in lanai. Roof is in excellent condition. This home was built in 2005. Nice screened in lanai, guys. Big, big lanai. Has a garden. So if you like to grow your own food and tomatoes and uh, cucumbers, any vegetables that you want to plant here, that's just fine, guys. Some nice bamboo trees on the side, lots of shade in the backyard. Now, if you notice, there's no intrusive oak trees in the immediate vicinity of the property. So there's no oak trees here. So you're not going to get that root coming up under the house or killing your grass. You know, the, the fencing yard, if you have a dog, goes all the way over here, guys. AC condi air conditioner is in great condition. Uh, it's even got shades in the lanai. So let's go check out in here, guys. As you can see. Let's see here. All tiled. So you got the shade, all vinyl windows throughout the whole house. Let's see guys. Exterior outlets, light. And come right into the kitchen guys. It's a good sized kitchen, lots of counter space. You have all these extra cabinets and drawers here. These are nice dovetail, soft clothes. Very nice kitchen, guys. All this storage. They can put some shelves up here. You could keep a picture. You can make this your coffee station. Backsplash. Crown molding on the top of the cabinets. Nice sink, breakfast bar, vinyl plank laminate. Throughout all the wet areas, I would say maybe that garbage disposal is a little aged, but it works great. Stainless steel appliances. This is a electric stove, nice refrigerator, side by side on top, the ice maker, water dispenser, and the pull out freezer. Storage above and here's your pantry. If you have plenty of cabinet space, vaulted ceilings, recessed lighting, 
vinyl plank laminate flooring. Comes with all your hurricane shutters in the garage. Say, uh, closet here, linen closet, oh, coat closet. Got all your fans, chandeliers, remotes. Here's your two bedroom, one bath. Over here, guys. Pull up bar, not included. This has got regular laminate flooring inside the bedrooms. Closet. House is in great condition, guys. They have one small dog. Well trained. There's no pet damage. Here's your hall bath. Matching vanity and cabinetry. Little pockets there. Nicely tiled. Nice toilet. Mirror, lighting, medicine cabinet. Knock down finish. Some space rugs in here. This is a private area, not this bedroom. Oh, both of the bedrooms actually. The windows are private. It goes out uh, into the yard there. Good sized closet in this room. Have some stools right here. Your bar. Go into the master. Vaulted ceilings. Lots of light. Walk in closet, guys. Shelving on top and bottom. Your shoes. And here's your master bath, guys. Sliding glass door on the shower. All tiled out. The accent tile. Windows for natural light. Oversized tub, guys. This is not your standard tub. It's oversized. You could, you could add a double vanity in here, no problem, guys. Plumbing's already in the wall. Here's your private toilet area. Look at that guys, look how high the ceiling is. Just opens it right up. It's a beautiful little house on the corner in a great location. For only 379 for under 400,000. It's move in ready. Doesn't need any work to move in. Go into the garage. Some stuff in here from the cellars, but this will all be cleared out. Good size two car garage. It even has like a little indention right there. So it has some extra space where the, the um, hot water heater is. So you have a little extra area here. It's actually your laundry. So this is gonna be tucked away, your laundry room. They've got some extra cabinets and counter space here for a workshop. Um, that, that'll be staying. Here's your AC blower here, guys. Let's see here. Need to know the information. All in good shape. No damage in the garage, all the knockdown finish on the ceilings. Here's your attic storage up here. I'd say just epoxy the floor maybe, right? If, if, if you even want to. Uh, let's check out the panel, guys. You know, obviously it's the newer code. It's 2005 house, so you're gonna have no issues with that. Square D. 
200 amp. Yeah, don't forget guys, it's got that extra wide. Like full disclosure guys, I do like to make sure you know what you're purchasing. So get that extra wide space there. There's your neighborhood sidewalks all the way around on both sides of the street. In this, you have your mailboxes. So your mailbox is actually gonna be right there. So it's not in front of the house, but it's right there on the other side of the house. But it's not like a community mailbox where you have to drive, you know, around the block to get to your mailbox. You just walk right across the street. All right, guys. So um, if you're interested in this listing, please reach out or have your real estate agent reach out to me at 941 879 4730. Also, I'm a licensed real estate agent. I'm a new construction specialist in the Parish, Florida area. So if you're thinking that you want to sell or buy, or maybe this isn't quite the right house for you, um, layout and price wise, maybe you're, you're looking for something um, a little bit bigger or whatever guys, whatever the case may be, maybe you need a two story I don't know, maybe you want a community pool in the neighborhood, just reach out to me guys um, at 941-879-4730. You go on my website, robertlunt.com for all my inventory and that's set to your GPS location on your phone or you can type in any zip code that you want and you'll be able to search properties uh, all day long and, and you know, specialized searches and save searches on my app as well guys. So once again, if you're interested in this, Awesome 3-2, two, two-car garage with 1,272 square feet, vaulted ceilings, updated kitchen, corner lot, fenced-in yard, screened-in lanai. Okay, guys, with the vinyl plank laminate flooring for under 400,000, right in the middle of everything in Palmetto, 941-879-4730. Talk to you soon, guys. Thank you very much. So here we go, guys. We're gonna be live on the MLS, Facebook Marketplace, all the groups, over 3,500 websites, YouTube. That's how I do my listings, guys. Sell them fast, present them properly. Here's the neighborhood, guys. It's actually Cisco up on the other side of this neighborhood. So it's one of the main you know, warehouses for Cisco, one of their headquarters. It's right there. As you come out of the neighborhood, guys. It's a nice neighborhood. Nice little neighborhood, nice little subdivision. 69th Street East. This is the 69th Street East side. 34th Ave. Here in Parkside. Like I said, so this way is gonna go to US 41. And actually, we'll probably go that way. This is 69th. This will take you to Buffalo Creek that way and all the new stores on 69th. So we have a new Dollar General up there, a new Dunkin' Donuts, a new Marco's Pizza. There's a new nail salon, a new UPS store. Like I said, you got Cisco right here, guys come around 69th and then you'll be at the gas station in the I-275. There's a nice farm store I've been eating at for years up around here. Um, they have the best sandwiches and Cuban sandwiches, um, Italian beefs, uh, best pies. I've been buying pies and bringing them to you know, holiday parties for years from there. Not much of a pie eater anymore, but I used to eat a lot of pies. <laughs> So, uh, Gulf Coast Corporate Park. So, it's um, a corporate park for different businesses in there, guys. Industrial businesses, shipping businesses, warehouse businesses. And this is all going to be a new, um, I believe they said that was going in there was a, a gas station, I want to say a storage facility, a car wash. 
think another fast food place. And you have Circle K. This used to be a shell, but it's a Circle K now. And there's the farm store, guys. And you would take this right, and this is a US 41, and you can hit I-275 right here. Um, might be the easiest way to get to the highways is this way right here, without with the least amount of traffic and lights. So that's the way I would suggest, guys, is going that way. So the storage facility there, plenty of storage facilities coming in. So off we go, guys. Hope you enjoyed this presentation.